This European-inspired bakery is a Toronto institution. Wait until you guys get a load of this place. It's super vintage, brass railings, old photos, which totally makes sense because it's been around since 1974. This popular bakery and cafe was one of many locations opened by Radenko Jelinek, a master pastry chef born in Vojvodina, a province in the northernmost part of Serbia. Almost 50 years later, this remains the sole bakery, which is now passed down to his son Gordy and his wife Angela. It remains one of the last European style bakeries in the city that makes everything from scratch. There are no preservatives or stabilizers, everything is made in-house, and everything that's made takes quite the process to do so. Unlike the desserts we're familiar with today, this bakery doesn't focus on sugar, but on ingredients like nuts, Belgian chocolate, or real whipped cream that truly enriches the flavors of their treats. This is why it's no surprise that this woman drove 20 plus hours from North Carolina to purchase their most popular dish, the strawberry Romanoff cake. I'll see you in probably about six months as soon as I finish this. Safe you know, driving, yeah. You know, I got a fork in the car Perfect. at some point. <laughs> Chef Dinesh gave us a behind the scenes look at how he makes their seven layer dobosh, which also happens to be a popular item for Easter. It's a cake so good, it'll have you say, This is good sh <laughs> Holy crap, this is delicious. They say it's all edible, so we're putting it to the test. Oh yeah. Find Sweet Gallery and the staff that's as sweet as the pastries they make at 350 Bearing Ave.